Huh. See? It works! I, I, I can see through the walls. What? Box to that, you just heard his footstep. No, 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 I'm deaf in one ear, remember, Sao Paulo? All right, the trombone player. Yeah, one on trombone player. But now that now that AJ's here, he can settle our little disagreement. Indeed, he can, but he's our guest, so let us be cordial. Ah, this one's a lovely juggling. Mm hmm. We call it Oculus Spliff. <sighs> As you see through the walls of perception. But you'll need a topper with that one, mate. <clears throat> What the hell? friend um, nam shiba, um, nam shiba, comes from afar seeking seeking answers we can give him those answers uh, yogi reggie is that you oh shit what the hell did those guys give me
Seconds in, it gets much worse. Oh! <laughs> I see my little concoction worked out for you. Our concoction? Ow. You drugged me. Again. We offered what you accepted. Ryan, you still have all your bits and bobs. No harm, no foul. Besides, now you have the recipe. Right, and you can glean the benefits of its effects anytime you want. Like a superpower. Exactly. And there's plenty more where that came from. You just come on back to us the next time we need a little kick, yeah? Until then, shall we? Okay. Windows don't do drugs, really? Is that it? Those fields you burnt, they weren't just drugs. They were books. They were medicine. Oh, damn it, we could have built a proper clinic. But no, Sabal says, drugs are bad and you torch a fucking future! I don't think you understand. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I speak out of turn? Should I walk ten feet behind you with my head bowed? You really? didn't see Kirat before the war. I was six years old. My parents told me I had to marry. Six! That's the world Sabal is pining for. Just saying. Look, Sabal is not everything he pretends to be. If he was so concerned about his tradition, why didn't he ask you to protect the statues of Kira? What? The Kira statues. Paul's trying to destroy them as part of his campaign to turn the people against the Golden Bar. Right now, it's the last thing we need. Yeah. 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 No mercy! 
Done. Thank you, brother. Those statues are why Kirat has a name. Now it's time to light the braziers, to remind everyone that Kira is watching over them. Sabal, how the hell do I get up to the braziers? Climb, brother. Climb. Yeah. <clears throat> 
Compound. He's vulnerable there. He likes to ship in his meat from a nearby village. That is your way in. Once you're inside, sneak into the interrogation room. This guard will be down. my way there. Okay. Look, you must sneak in. It's important. Paul is a rat, and rats always find a way off a sinking ship. He can't suspect anything until it's too late. And don't forget, AJ, he's throwing a party. So find out where he's kidnapping his meat and sneak in with him. I want everyone from the warehouse loaded up to the truck. The prisoners from the warehouse aren't loaded into the truck already. Get in and sit down. <laughs> I think this one's just going to
Sabal, I'm going after Paul. Capture him if you can, brother. I want him to pay for what he's done to Kirat. In fact, a lot of people keep disappearing from nearby villages. So if you find anyone alive inside, help them escape. But go in quietly. I'm not afraid of any 
your head down. Sabal, I freed some prisoners. Good. Every person you save is another soldier for the cause, brother. Now finish what you have to do. Sabal and I were on the same path in this kid. That's what I'm going tell you. That man is true. All of you keep your eyes open. Keep looking. Check everywhere. Find whatever did this. I thought this killer found. Go, go, go. Nobody kills my buddy. You hear me? Nobody. It could be more than one person. Nobody kills my buddy. You hear me? Nobody. The killer got away! <laughs> no, I understand. Goodhart, I understand. I, I, I can't. I'm literally walking into a meeting right now. All right. No, it's okay. It's okay. Just, just put her on really quick. No, 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 it's okay. Put her on. Yeah. I will be right with you. Hi, Ashley. You did? That is amazing! <laughs> Good girl, are you getting ready for bed? Did you brush your teeth? For at least 10 seconds? That's my girl. <sighs> Gonna give your mom a big kiss for me? <sighs> well, you know, she gets lonely when I'm not there. You are the lady of the house. Of course, now you know daddy has to work, so... A gift? Sure, sweetheart, what did you want? A ring. No, I, I don't think I've seen anything like that for you, sweetheart. I'm sorry. What else would you like? A necklace. Oh, a gold necklace. Well, actually, I think I see that exact thing. Yes, of course, it is shiny. Now, listen, Daddy has to work, all right? So I have to go. I, I love you, too. Yes. Kisses, kisses. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Okay. Bye, Ladybug. I apologize for that. My daughter, you were here on time, and I was not ready. No disrespect intended. You?
flag! Kill every level you see! Let's finish this! Sends her regards. Noor? <laughs> Noor? <laughs> uh, what? I mean, she thinks her family's still alive? <laughs> oh, oh, man, we killed them years ago. <laughs> Dear mommy letters, I've been writing them myself. Well, with Ashley, my daughter's help, I uh, <laughs> I told her it was for a pen pal. <laughs> she's a real tearjerker, my Ashley. I really think she's got the stuff to be a writer one day. You know, she wrote this poem in the third grade. Made me and the wife ball like babies. Come on! Don't be like that! Don't pretend you give a damn when you don't! Huh? Find your inner truth, Ajay! <laughs> and the truth is you're good at killing! I am good at enhanced interrogation, and you're great at good old-fashioned slaughter! Come on, take a look around you! This place was built for guys like us! Do you really care what happens to anyone here, huh? Or you just chosen to get back out there and leave a trail of bodies in your way?
He's alive. If you'd killed him, I wouldn't have blamed you. Yeah, I'm alive. Fucking taxi driver. Show him to his new home. Who threw that? Fucking savages! Let go! Wait, wait, that's my cell phone. Ajay, that's my cell phone. It's in my back pocket. I, I need my cell phone, man! Ajay, please! Please, I need my cell phone! Get off me, you monkey fuckers! Ashley! Ashley, baby, daddy's here! Thank you, Ajay. This is a good thing you've done here. We'll take care of Paul. We've got the perfect spot for him. Ajay, now that Paul's taken care of, Pasha got fortune. Ajay Gale, the man with the golden name. Who is this? Ajay, I'm hurt. <laughs> you don't recognize my voice? Should I? The voice of Radio Freaky Rat? This is Rabbi Ray Rana. You don't, you don't recognize that? Right, Rabbi Ray Rana. Just call me Rabbi Ray, man. Okay, Rabbi Ray, what's this about? Look, we need a face-to-face. -face. I'm sending you my coordinates. Come find me, man. I was in America not so long ago. I looked up Bishwari, but I couldn't bring myself to see her. Not at all these years. You always regret those decisions when they die, don't you? Anyway, I was there with Deplore, or rather Paul Harmon. He invited me to his home to meet his family, to see the other side of him. It was incredible to see the man behind the man. Paul, the loving father and husband. I was as jealous as I was happy for him. We went to his daughter's school to see a recital. There was his darling Ashley, the light of his life. I could see the tears welling up in his eyes. So proud, so much love. It really made me think, what if I had followed Ishwari? What if that was you clumsily stumbling through a piano recital as I looked on Terry Eye through a viewfinder, capturing every precious moment? It always hits you when it's too late, RJ. Always when they've gone. I think this is easy. Being the first woman in the golden bath. The one pushing for change while everybody else talks behind your back about how you're destroying their heritage. I am every bit the fighter, the kirati that they are, but they, they just see a woman. You're a smart man, Ajay, tell me. Am I the right person for this? Sabal, he's got all these supporters, and I just, I just keep thinking, are they blind? Or am I just... Missing the point. No, indecision is for the weak. Okay. Remember that tea plantation? The poppies, they've been shipped to an old brick factory for processing. Sabal wants to destroy it, he's so sure of himself. And you want to capture it? Exactly. That's everything we need to plan for the future while he's stuck in the past. I say yes, he says no. But I'm hoping you will be the one to do the right thing. I'll do it. I was hoping you'd say that. I need you to take Noah's brick factory without destroying it. We'll put it to good use later. Ajay, be careful, huh? It's very well guarded.
Ajay, Amita said you'd be along. Stop up on the ammo. The Havadar is waiting for you up the hill. Are you Havildar? What you'd call sergeant, yes. The factory uses generators to make the air breathable. Destroy them, and you force the soldiers out. Whatever you do, keep damage to a minimum. One more thing. Chief Chemist, who runs the facility, he used to be one of us. Amita wants him dead. Keep shooting! 
shooting! Generalized prediction based on testing and acceptance and hypothesis is a guess that has yet to be tested. How? What the fuck is happening? The energy is transferred. Shit. It's it's the gas. We live in the age of You said... You, you said to kill him! It's time to destroy the facility. It's time to light Badra's ascension to the gods with a giant blaze. You're not making any sense. We're laying the explosives now. Get out while you can! Ajay, what's wrong? Is the factory secured? Is the chemist dead? Yeah. Yeah, I just, uh... I think I was hallucinating. That's the fumes. But you're okay now. I can't tell you what this means. Thanks to you, Kirat has a future. <laughs> if Sabal wasn't so busy looking backwards, he'd see that too. <laughs> Mr. Gale. We have been watching you. It's time we meet. Further instructions will be provided when you reach these coordinates. Yeah! 
to do that. You're in this to fight the good fight and shoot bad guys, not play 20 questions. The sooner you help me, the sooner you can get back to evoking stand your ground laws on foreign soil. Besides, I have intel for you. Hello? Are you still there? Ah, great. Airport. Good. I did a flyby earlier and spotted some snipers. Clear them out. And remember, we have a common enemy. Taking out Pagan's men will make it easier to secure the airport for your Golden Path comrades. Right. One more thing. You'll need to keep a low profile, like a Republican living in San Francisco. No alarm. Don't get spotted, period. I've got a meeting with the commander stationed at the airfield, and I don't want him to know I have an ace up my sleeve. Once you're done, call me! Okay, it's safe to land now. I took out the snipers. Nice work. I'm coming in for a landing. Get to the control tower and call me when you're there.
I'm in position. Stay there and watch my back. I've got a quick little sit down to deal with before we can chat. If this meeting goes south, I'll give you a signal. What kind of signal? When I say Reaganomics, open fire and don't stop till all the bad guys are gone. Reaganomics? Okay. I'm gonna keep this channel open, but stay quiet. I don't need any distractions. This guy can be a little jumpy. Got it? Got it. Good. Here we go. Got the goods right here, just like you asked for. Change of plans. What's that now? I said change of plans. Yuma wants me to bring you in. You kidding me? You can't do that. We had a deal. You and your plane aren't going anywhere. I'm taking you to Yuma. Well, let's try to work something out, okay? There's nothing to work out here, buddy. Where I come from, a deal's a deal. You can't just change things up. It's un-American. I've had enough of this. Are you familiar with policy that ensured the fiscal future of the United States? Yuma said to bring you in, but she did say I had to bring you in alive. You under fire? I'm taking fire! Look at bad guys coming in from the north! Get on it! Contact from the south! Put them down! Got it! 
Judging by the lack of gunshots and explosions I'm hearing, I'd say you're in the clear. Come find me in the warehouse so we can finally get some face time. years and I still can't figure out if that smell is bad sanitation or just the abject loss of hope. I don't smell anything. Point keeping up with that facade anymore. So who are you? Now look at you. American on the inside and useful on the outside. You're the perfect wolf in sheep herder's clothing. Way better than the SoCal douchebag I had to babysit at my last stop. You're both patriots, though. Both the type that'll put your hand over your gosh darn heart when you hear the Star Spangled Banner at a Fourth of July ball game. <laughs> Useful on the outside. I work for Langley, Agent Willis Huntley. Langley, as in CIA. Everything you need to know about who killed your father is in that file. What file? The one in the plane that's about to take off. Shit. Hey, you're gonna need this. Yeah, and it doesn't tell me shit. Redacted. You want to know more? Keep your mouth shut and help me with the job. Then I pull off more of those black bars. Fine. What's the job? I'm here to bring down Pagan Min and Yuma. Something the locals can't seem to pull off. I thought you people were good at waging guerrilla warfare. You people? Golden Path's waging the wrong kind of fight. I'm here to show them how it's done. Step one, hand him the airport. Step two, recruit the services of one A.J. Gale. That's you. Meet me back here when you're ready. Oh, and don't mention our little arrangement to the Golden Path. They're not in the need-to-know column. Now, if you'll excuse me, I gotta hit the crapper. Pardon my French. Don't turn your back to the enemy! Jesus Christ, it's just a freaking hole in the ground. 